commit yourselves fully. Whether you are a brahmachari, whether you are a grihastha, whether you are a sannasi, the main objective that we have is to keep ourselves involved in Krishna consciousness. And to remain involved, we have to have the goal. And that goal is to spread Krishna consciousness all over the world, every town and village. And the means is Sankirtan. The broader means of Sankirtan is distributing books and preaching, uh, etc. But the essential means of Sankirtan actually is chanting the holy name congregationally. Like we are trying to bring people in through distribution of books and other things. But when they come, then what do we do? We have to engage them in service. We have to engage them in Sankirtan. So engaging them in Sankirtan means engage them in spreading Krishna consciousness. Engage them in doing Harinam. Like when I remember how Prabhupada started the movement. Uh, alone, Prabhupada went to Tompkins Square Park in New York and with the kartal he was chanting. And the chanting, sorry, the chanting attracted everybody. So I was actually thinking that one of the things that you can do to really feel that involvement in Krishna consciousness and motivating others also to give that feeling is by doing Harinam. Yeah, do the book distribution and things are also very nice. That is essential. But Harinam should not be neglected. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu did that. Throughout the day, Mahaprabhu was doing the Nagar Sankirtan and at night in the house of Srivash Thakur, he was doing the Sankirtan, chanting the holy name. So this is how we have to see the importance of the holy name. So, okay, I will suggest something now and see if you can get involved in doing that. I will suggest that all of you select a specific area. Doesn't have to be very big area. Like, uh, and motivate a few people to come with you and do Nagar Sankirtan. Chant in the morning or whenever it's possible. Haribo. So uh, see if that is possible. Maybe you can write to me about your feelings about that. Like there are so many things that comes to my mind, so many memories that come to my mind. Initially, Srila Prabhupada started the movement just by this Harina in Tompkins Square Park in New York. When Calcutta was about to be bombed and people are running away from Calcutta, Srila Prabhupada did the Harinam there. And it is the Harinam in San Francisco that attracted George Harrison. I mean, he became interested in the devotees who were chanting in the streets like that. Nowadays in America, uh, many people ask us, where are you? There was a time we used to be feel like you are everywhere. And now we don't see any, anywhere. That's because they are not seeing us doing Harinam. So this Harinam is going to be uh, 
the the factor the mood and the movement that's going to attract people to our movement so please uh, take note of it take note of this and see what you think of it and it will be nice if you can select some areas and consider that if you are in a temple then make it a point inspire the devotees in the temple to go out if not every day at least you know few days a week regularly one of my god brothers batu gopal prabhu he was in he was in uh, north carolina hillsboro and every saturday he was teaching in an university but and he had his uh, three daughters and wife and himself if no one else came just five of them were going out doing the hari nam on saturdays so these are the commitments that devotees had you know like these are the examples that you can follow and so please think about it because i know through this hari nam it will create a very very powerful uh, very powerful force in spreading krishna consciousness like say if 100 of you select 100 areas and make it a point to take, inspire people to go out in hari nam and you know let us see what happens after three months so please uh, take it upon yourselves seriously wherever you are if you are in a temple inspire the devotees if you are not in a temple motivate your neighbors or your friends uh, or inspire other devotees to come and join you prabhu on uh, saturday and sunday in the morning and uh, thursday in the evening i am thinking of doing hari nam in my area will you please come and you know like take the mridanga and kartal and just do hari nam hari krishna maha mantra so that is how the juga dharma uh, the sankirtan movement will spread the juga dharma will spread so please take it upon yourself seriously hmm. wherever you are just make it a point to do out go out in hari nam you see i am saying you saying all these things because my main concern is to motivate you so that you become committed to krishna consciousness more intensely otherwise you are chanting 16 rounds and reading proper books and so forth they are there they kind of they're taking care of your sadhana but now we have to actually consider how to take it to others and this is the way we have to take it to others through sankirtan and also i am thinking of doing having some programs in some cities in uh, different cities in uh, west bengal and one of the things that i am thinking of doing is just hari nam in the morning just do the hari nam and invite people one or two days that will be there three days will be there let's just try to get them to come to krishna consciousness mm. so this is we have to see how to spread krishna consciousness and you know like the it will move it will take over the whole world it will spread all over the world in every town and village when we become serious about it we consider how we are going to spread this movement how we are going to take this movement to every town and village you may say well i am mean, in india and there is already preaching is going on that's fine but just as drops of water fill up the ocean we should recognize that my little contribution will add to this propagation of krishna consciousness all over the world 
So <clears throat> please take it seriously. And um, I'm going back to India in a few days. I'll be in Tirupati for about from 12 till 19 for about a week. Then in Mayapur, 20, Calcutta to 19th, Mayapur 20th till I think 25th. So those who are in India, I will see you during that time. And so you all become uh, nicely involved. And please, uh, those who think, those who of you who are thinking that this is an important suggestion, then you let me know how you're going to do, how you're going to start doing Harina, wherever you are. Even if it is just three or four devotees going out, don't worry. You know, like when Calcutta was supposed to be bombed, Srila Prabhupada went out with just one devotee. Just one devotee, uh, and who was a young, young boy, and maybe he was his servant. And just with him, he went out. When everybody was running away from Calcutta, Srila Prabhupada just went to chant in the city without leaving the city. And, and Japanese didn't bomb Calcutta. And if you ask me, I will say they didn't, they changed their mind because Srila Prabhupada was chanting the Holy Name. So this is the power of the Holy Name. Always have that conviction that this is how powerful this Holy Name is. This is how powerful Krishna is. And the Holy Name is non different from Krishna himself. So please take it upon yourselves very seriously. So <clears throat> um, I don't know whether we have any question answer session. Uh, Krishna Kishore, do we have possibility of question answer? We, we are sending to uh, Rasaraj Prabhu's phone, Gurmaj. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So there are some questions. It's good. Um, so now this one is for, is that from you? Okay, Apurva Gopal Das from Bangalore. I had following questions. What practical steps we can take to overcome stage of offensive chanting? Offensive chanting to overcome offensive chanting is, remember what are the offenses, 10 offenses and not commit them. Don't commit those offenses. That is the only way. Uh, and you can say internally, become pure. Don't become humble. Don't offend anybody. Special the Vaishnavas. Don't commit offenses to the Vaishnavas. Uh, and remain humble internally. It will happen. It's ultimately, it's a matter of purification of heart. You know, why are the offenses? Because the heart is contaminated. Is due to the contamination of the heart, like envy, greed, anger, we commit the offenses. So purify yourself, purify your heart, and then only you'll be able to chant purely. How should we get, next question, how should we get rid of the tendency of being mechanical while rendering sadhana bhakti? Well, do it with a sense of duty and then the sense of duty. See, mechanical means no feeling. Just like a machine, you're doing something. But the next step is just do it with a sense of duty. And the next step is to do it out of your love for Krishna, love for Sri Prabhupada. So this is how the gradual uh, uh, development will take place. So next is Gaurav Shwa. I will surely start doing Sankirtan in Gurgaon. When I sing Vaishnava song, I see that the words in Vaishnava songs are very good, but my position is not elevated enough 
to think like that. There's a huge gap between my mood and mood of Vaishnava songs. So in a way, I am not truthful what to do. Anyway, so the, when you're going out and do Sankirtan, just stick to the holy name. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare. So that is uh, our business of chanting the Sankirtan. And Vaishnava Bhajan, maybe the difficulty is you are not relating to it because the language is different. You are not understanding. But whatever it is, keep on chanting. Keep on chanting and try to understand the meaning also. Amritesh Gordas, Bhuvaneshwar. Sometimes devotees take commitments for chanting some extra rounds regularly. Is it a greater commitment or should you try for Harinam Sankirtan in place of that? Because personally, I don't have such taste to chant extra rounds. Kindly enlighten me. Yeah, like, uh, I mean, our understanding is that Prabhupada asks us to chant 16 rounds minimum. So minimum 16 rounds we chant. Then after that, whether we want to chant or whether we want to go out in Sankirtan or whether we want to do bo both, uh, like chant some extra rounds and at the, as well as go out in Sankirtan. Harinam Sankirtan, Nagar Sankirtan. Uh, that is, uh, both are beneficial, both are good. So, I think that's it, three questions. Any other question? Okay then, so write to me about your ideas about Harinam. There's a few questions coming. Just... A couple of questions coming in one minute. This is Devesh from Chester, Virginia. What is other things we have to do to go back to Godhead other than chanting? Well, just do that and the rest automatically will happen. Just chant the Holy Name. And if you want to do other things, there are so many things you can do. Like four regulated principles is another thing that we are doing. Rendering devotional service is another thing we are doing. But you must remember that the chanting of the Holy Name is the most important. Any other question? So, okay. So you all write to me about your ideas of Harinam and I expect that many of you will commit yourselves to this request of mine. Please, please do that. Thank you very much. All glories to Shri Prabhupada. Gold Premanande Hari Hari Bo. Two more questions. <laughs> okay. Some more questions are coming. Will new students be able to uh, relate with Sankirtan? We go in pan shirts to preach to them. How should we proceed? From Ram Charan Das Ujjain. Um, well, you see, when you're approaching, then probably they do not know who you are and what you want. But then in course of your preaching, you explain to them. Just tell, just explain to them what the Harinam is meant for. Prabhupada explained it so in, wonderfully. Uh, the importance of chanting the holy name as a congregation. Ours is a Juga Dharma. So explain these things to 
the devotees who are maybe initially reluctant to do that. <clears throat> Jogendra Krishna Das, oh, I'm sorry, Jadavendra Krishna Das, I am stuck, I'm stuck in a situation where I'm not able to decide between spiritual activities and my material activities. Like I have some office work and other routine work. And on the other side, I have spiritual, like we have classes in temple of senior sannyasis and others activities where I want to go and take part, but not able to decide. Okay, like, as much as possible, engage yourself in the spiritual activity. And also, Prabhupada used to say, dovetail your material activity. Like you're working, but consider that you are working to make the money to maintain your household, which is, your house is Krishna's temple. Your family members are Krishna's devotees. So when you earn money to maintain them, then that earning becomes your devotional service. See, Arjun is fighting a battle and that's his devotional service to Krishna. So what, tell me what service cannot become devotional service? Navadip Nimai Das Bhopal, how can I overcome the stage Fear of going out for Nagar Sankirtan as a student because people question that my duty is to study, not to do Harinam. Good questions. Like if you're a student, focus in your studies. Uh, and if possible, with your friends, you can do Kirtan uh, and things. But yes, I can understand for as a student, going out in Nagar Sankirtan will not be practical. Uh, so. When you are independent, when you are on your own, then it will be easier. So wait for that time. So Premananda Krishna Das from Singapore, Guru Maharaj in Singapore, we can't do Sankirtan in outside as it is prohibited here. What should we do in such countries? Yes, yeah, yeah it is understandable. It is not possible to do outside. But one thing you can, if you go out in a park and sit down and chant, will there be any objection? That is one thing you can consider. Maybe you won't be walking in the streets, but go to some place, sit, go out to a park or go to the beach or go to some public places like that and sit down and just do the Harinam or Bhajan. That becomes very effective. In countries like Switzerland, Zurich, they do that. And people love it when they see devotees chanting like that. Thank you. Okay, so I will uh, end it now. Thank you all very much. All glories to Srila Prabhupada. And I look forward to seeing you soon. Hare Krishna. Who's one of the six?